We were tagged again <laughs> as Mad Rose D this time, though. Last time it was Beyond Reality. Thank you, Metavog. Yes, yeah, so our good friend Metavog out in California has tagged us. So we're going to uh, give you five more facts. We had to dig for these. As if five wasn't <laughs> enough. Because <laughs> our lives are pretty pitiful. All right, so number one, we're straight up suckers. For animals. <laughs> That's right. If, uh, if we didn't have... Your father and my husband to say, stop it. <laughs> We'd have a thousand pets here. Because we just feel bad. Mm -hmm. In fact, every time the ASPCA commercial comes on on the TV, we either have to cry or turn it off. <laughs> because I, I, I feel can't. like going down to the ASPCA and saying, all right, give me five more. I, I just have to. Mm -hmm. Or like bring them a bag of food or something. I or love the animals. Yes, we're suckers for the animals. Mm -hmm. And if we're not, who's going to take care of them? Are you? <laughs> all right. Fact number two. I will avoid at all costs using a public restroom. I think anyone would. I it's don't think disgusting. there's people out there out there that are like, oh, let me use that public bathroom. Come I gotta on, that. I've seen some people who are just like, hey, no problem. Any port in a storm, baby. I would rather die. <laughs> if I gotta go, I'm going. All right. I'm not going to put on a diaper like that crazy astronaut, but you know what? They said she didn't do it. <laughs> All right. <laughs> All right, let's move along to fact number three. Okay. <laughs> I have this little thing. I have to have my TV on if I'm going to fall asleep. Okay, I used to be the same exact way before YouTube, but now that I only get two or three hours of sleep a night, I don't need the TV. No, I need the background music. Or whatever, not music, whatever. I don't need it because I just, if I didn't fall asleep, I'd be dead. All right, fact number four. Well, I mean, because I'm also terrified of the dark, so I need the light coming from it too in the corner of my eye. Okay. I mean, that light coming out of the crack of your head isn't enough? No. Oh, well. All right, fact number four. Now, this is very scary, and yes. we don't like to think about this. Three years ago, we both had white platinum hair. This hair? Picture that. No, I had yellow hair. No, it was white. It was yellow. Mine was white. It was yellow and then white. <laughs> okay. And then it was gray, and they called you grandma. Yeah. For a day, the transition between blonde and brown, I had to dye it twice because it wasn't enough. I know. <laughs> I had silver hair, but there were tints of blue in the light. It was very attractive. It was. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so... That brings us to our last fact, which is not very fun at all. A little backstory here. I have been playing the clarinet for seven years. An eternity. It is my baby. I know. That clarinet was such a find. So. <laughs> and we loved it. Some sick mother effer. Yeah, straight up. Has stolen my clarinet from school. We just found that out this week. And I got so depressed today that I thought I was just going to cry. I, am, I have cried. I cried many times since I found out. And I am very upset. I don't blame you. I feel just as violated as you do. I don't know how you can walk into that band room every day and... Every other day. Every other day. <laughs> well, then it's only half as bad. It's tough. I, and think that your clarinet is in someone's greasy paws that maybe sold it or like is doing things to it i mean there's no mistaking that it was yours you had your name and address on with like a freaking neon tag right on no, it no you just made that up <laughs> but there is a name <laughs> thanks i'm just saying you made it up so i'm very you used to have a neon tag no <laughs> so if i find out who did it i will first grab it from you I will kick you in the anus so hard <laughs> that you will have to dig my foot out of your butthole. You mean your foot won't come out their mouth? No. Alright. Because it's going to get stuck in their ribs. Ooh. I'd hate to be the person who took that because I'm really pissed. Seriously, like, instruments cost hundreds of, hundreds of dollars. And even besides that little fact, it's a piece of... Of my life. You might as well steal her liver. Her spit was in there. That's not even what I'm saying. I... <laughs> You're missing the whole point. I know what you mean. I mean it was part of you. Yes. And now some person has it. 
So, uh, before we both start to cry <laughs> and bring down the entire YouTube... I will go Chris Crocker if I don't have it within this week. <laughs> You're not going to have it, honey. It's long gone, I'm sure. All right, so we need to tag some peeps. I don't know how to say this name, but I love this girl. She's a sweetheart. Sano E is sheer. here. Oh, or, I thought it was sheer. <laughs> no. <laughs> I thought it was like Sanwa Sheer. Oh, Sano is here for. Okay, next. You know how to say this I can't, one now. I can't. Angelo Peligi. You're tagged. <laughs> Monkey Fack. You are tagged. <laughs> Oh, my favorite. Bull Z Hitter 77. 77. Or bull Jitter. <laughs> yeah, he's a Bull Jitter. We bull know that your mic's not working, dude, so if you could do something. If you want to write it, it. Yeah, that's cool. You know, that's definitely cool. Good. And of Big Brother fame, John E.E. <laughs> e. Coca. <laughs> Kids, you know what to do. Make yes. the video five facts, fun or shocking, mm -hmm. and pass it on. Yep. So, kidlings, <laughs> until next time, when we get tagged again, don't do it. <laughs> We're not. I'm not doing it. I'm too depressed. <laughs> I'm going to go cry now, like Chris Crocker. Much, Much love. love.